be the Kieran. Rain is doing homework right now, so he won't be in the video. Subscribe, like, notifications, notifications, please. Okay. Watch our other videos. And today we are going. You've probably read the title. We are going to rank the 14 Diary of Wimpy Kid books. And you're like, wait, there's 13. Well, I'm counting Awesome Friendly Kid since it is part of the Diary of Wimpy Kid series. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get started. You know? Okay. Let's get started. You might not agree with me, but number 14 is Cabin Fever. I think this book is terrible. I hate Manny in this one, especially. Look! What? Yeah, look. This family looks miserable. Everything and everybody just never has a smile at all. And especially Manny, how he traps his family in cold, so he's basically freezing. So. Everybody else is freezing to death while he has all the food and warmth. And then he complains when they find out that it's because he nobody taught him to tie his shoes. I hate that book. Number 13 is The Long and Hard Luck. Yeah. This one's pretty bad. At least it's better with quality and the ending's kind of nice, but yeah. I just hate this. I feel bad for Greg. And Rally's just also bad. Terrible. Yeah. I, this one's kind of boring, but yeah. You stopped it. Number 12 is The Third Wheel. This is the book that's right under hard luck i think it's better just because like a little more crisp drawings and stuff long story yeah this story is kind of interesting but really i feel bad for greg in this one um look he at this look at this find some, somebody Cut off. well i like my top because you're not a big deal though god okay <laughs> Then there, then yeah, at the end it's just bad, and, oh, I, I just did it. Number 11 is Double Down. This is the 11th book, and I'd say this is just kind of bad. I mean, I like how it's like the cheese and stuff. But really, I don't like it. I don't like the I am spooky guy. Or the shots of... Or the drawing of his Nana in heaven. Naked in a bathtub. Yeah. I don't like Greg in this one. Or Roderick. I don't like any of the characters. The only character I really like... Is... The mom. But that's it. Number 10 is The Ugly Truth. I'm pretty sure I said number 10 for Double Down, but I'm at number 11. Um, The Ugly Truth. I kind of ripped it, but yeah. Um, This one's kind of a bad one. It's boring, very bad. It gets higher than those ones because I kind of like this story. It's interesting. And then I like Uncle Gary. Probably my favorite character from the series. Or Rally, I'm not sure. Um... Yeah, that's it, really. Number nine is The Long Haul. I know a bunch of you would, like, put this at your number one, but really, I don't see it. The Also, the movie is even worse than the book. Book, so yeah. I don't like the festival. The only thing I do like is, like, the adventures they go through. So fun. But all the characters are stupid. Mindless, idiotic, hyperactive jerks, especially Roderick, and gross place and bizarre places they go in. 
But then, I just like the fun stuff and the drawings are great. Yeah. Number eight is, I don't agree, normally I put this on number two, but Dog Days. I had Rand help me, he's just not in the video. But, yeah, Dog Days, classic. I'm literally right next to him, okay? Don't think yeah. that I'm somewhere else. Shh. Like, look at that shower. The good things is that it has an interesting story. I like all the s characters and the summertime theme. Sweetie is good. Roderick is still bad, but yeah. I think the good part is when uh, he goes through the men's shower place, and then there's yeah, there's I men guess. like la lu la lu. Okay, la, okay, la, okay. La, okay. La. Yeah, the bad part is the drawings kind of weird. Well, it is the fourth book, but still. It's just funky looking weird. It's awful. Yeah. Number seven is The Getaway. I love this book. Look at that illuminated title. Um, but yeah. I like the vacation stuff. I don't like how they get tortured from it, but yeah. So the vacation... And I like the plane scene, I like the uh, vacation stuff. Yeah, I like the stories, except it just comes to total chaos. Literally, chaos. Number six is old school. Also, it's, I'm pretty sure the start of the creative title. Um, yeah, this one is interesting. It's interestingly good. I like the black part, how it's char the characters go old-timey, how they, like, do a business, and then the, um, cottage stuff. Yeah. It's pretty funny. It's pretty, it's pretty funny, I would say. Yeah, it's very funny. The only bad stuff is it's mindless. Kind of, and... Yeah, everybody's dumb. Yeah. The only character yeah. that seems alright is probably Riggs, elementary assistant. Yeah. True. Yeah. True. Number five. Kicking into the top five, we have the original. This one's a cool classic to many people. Well, being the original, I like how they go to work out and the play and how yeah. The only thing I don't like is Greg and how he acts to rally, but yeah. This one's just a fun book. Fun stuff. So much great things. Yeah. I love it. Number four is the new the second newest one. The Meltdown. Probably has the coolest eliminated title. Just look at that. Yeah. So, um, The Meltdown is a pretty decent book. Decent? I mean, great. The only thing I don't like is the cold, cold to torture and the heat torture. <coughs> but yeah, I like everything else. It feels like, and, um, it feels like good. At the end, it's chaos, but I like the battling scenes to the last. Every other character is just a jerk, but yeah. I just love this book. It's so good. Kicking into the top three, we have Roger Rules. This one is pretty cool, I'd say. I don't like Rally in this one, but yeah. Greg's pretty good. He's not an idiot, except for the invisible. Little Chirage joke. I didn't like that. Rally's birthday is my favorite hit the scene from this. Favorite, like, I don't know, from this book. And the story in this book. Yeah. And then I like Rory and his Greg's comment about Rory the monkey. Yeah. Um, I like the grandpa on this one. Number two is. The last drop. This is chaos, but this is That's, literal it's chaos. Funny. It's funny. It's, it's, it's funny. funny. Good plot. Greg and bonds with his yeah. dad a little bit. 
I like the church scenes. I just I like all the like stuff, the adventures he's going through, even though it's not really adventures. Yeah. Just kind of. The only thing I don't like is the idiotic dad. Yeah, but that's it. And coming in at number one is the newest book, Awesome Forever. <laughs> Finally, we get a story from another person's perspective. Yeah. I like the drawing style, it's unique. Yeah. And this really shows how much of a jerk Greg is to Rowdy. Yeah. Yeah, Greg, um, in his own books, he doesn't write him as such a jerk too much yeah, about Aaron Yeah, Rowley, yeah it's bad. A lot. So and nine. Bad. At the ninth page, Greg already wants to make his book, Rally, his book, and I just say, Rally, do your own thing, about himself. Who, and screw you, Greg. And let me grab my own, my own, yeah. or my own. This is mine. Yeah, this is yours. Here it is. This is his. Um, this is my, this is my copy. Um, and here's something funny that I really liked about it, and see, hey, he copied me, and he, he, there it says, hi, I'm a jolly jerk person. Yeah, I like Yeah, that. and then you totally stole my idea. Yeah. Okay, then, who's this guy? Yeah, I don't like how he's like, trust me, you won't. Trust me, you won't. And then at the last page, he's like, yes. I, I told you. you it was gonna be bad. Actually, Greg, it was yeah. better than your books yeah. and your movies. You yeah, and, it, and then it says, he totally stole my idea. Greg's a jerk in this yeah. one. But but jerk. still, I still. love Rally's perspective. Yeah. All the adventures and chapters they go through. Chapters. And, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. No, don't. No, no, no. He's got something to say. What is it? Subscribe, like, mm -hmm. comment. Notice Turn on the, the notifications. Please, I pray you. Thank you for watching our videos. Bye. Bye.